What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix lag and FPS drops while playing Call of Duty Mobile on your iOS or Android device. This should be quite an easy tutorial. For more information, click on the first link in the description below. We will first take a look at your in-game settings. Open up Call of Duty Mobile and navigate to your Audio and Graphic Settings tab which will have a lot of impact on the performance and quality of your gameplay. I will set these for a low to mid-end device, as it will in turn also reduce distractions generated by the game and will help you run Call of Duty Mobile smoothly on any mobile device you wish to use. In the Graphics tab, set the Graphic Quality setting to your available performance. In most cases, you will want to set this option to low or medium. For my iPhone 11 Pro Max, I will set this option to medium. Below, set the frame rate option to maximum. This will give you the highest possible FPS, which will in most cases be bottlenecked by your display's refresh rate. The graphic style option will have no impact on your performance, so set this according to your preference. In the Battle Royale settings section, disable Depth of Field, as well as the Real Time Shadows, Water Reflection, Ragdoll and Anti-Aliasing options. Some users also prefer to disable Bloom. Below, in the Multiplayer settings, you should also disable Anti-Aliasing to get the best performance when playing Call of Duty Mobile on your device. The same settings apply for the Zombies mode. You can manually adjust your screen below. This is useful for users who have a notch on their device, where otherwise the game controls could be too close to the screen sides. Lastly, make sure to tap on Start Shader Preload. This will preload the game's shaders before joining a game, which will reduce lag and loading times. Make sure that you have a few minutes to spare, as this step can take some time to complete. After applying your changes, make sure to prevent other applications from running in the background, especially resource-intensive applications or apps that can use up your network connection can impact your Call of Duty mobile gaming experience. Next, open up your native settings application. On your iOS device, scroll down and tap on General. First. Make sure that your iOS device is up to date. Select Software Update and make sure to download and install the latest update in case there's one available to you. Next, in your iPhone or iPad storage settings, you can preview how much storage you have left and how much each application is using up on your device. To increase your overall Call of Duty Mobile performance and reduce FPS drops, you will need enough available storage on your device. Games like Call of Duty generate and delete files in the background when the game is being used. If you don't have enough storage left, then writing and deleting data can be slow and induce lag. I would suggest making sure that you have at least 5 GB of free storage left. Next, back in your general settings, tap on Background App Refresh. Here. You should simply turn this setting off while in-game, to prevent your device from updating other applications while in-game. The battery saver mode can also reduce your performance and induce FPS drops, so make sure that your device is charged and the battery saver mode is disabled while playing Call of Duty. Lastly, make sure to restart your mobile device in case you haven't done this in a while. This will restart some services and processes and will increase your performance when playing Call of Duty Mobile. In case you have any further issues or problems following this tutorial, then I suggest following my extensive guide linked in the description below. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.